is just how it be two people be stumbling across shit. Oh, it's not. Oh, this is tarantula. Don't you fuck with that. Are those poisonous? Candy. Oh, don't you dare. He's going to take it. Such a kid. Such a kid. I'm like, you're going to have to. Is there a hole in that thing so you can get air? Oh my god. Can you take the spider? Turn this off. That means something. Can take that. Oh, okay. you're Heisenberg. <laughs> Listen, I'm sorry to drop in on you out of the blue. No, no, it's no, been no, Italian, no. Like it's, no, no, I'm just uh, kind of settling into the new digs here. What do you think, huh? Oh, this is very nice. The new digs. Yeah. Uh, Steve, would you mind if uh, I, I've got to run something by Hank? If it's all right. Yeah. Yeah. Somebody better go chase the bad guys. So that mean Hank's off the case? Because he said he's done chasing that. He's a oh. Oh, yeah, I see that. Wow. That's beautiful. Yeah. Isn't that a uh, birthday? Uh, yeah. Definitely. Well. Remember? No, no, I'm just saying. He's what? probably thinking, like, you don't wear stuff like yeah. that. <laughs> uh, new car, new watch. Yeah. Good for you. Mm -hmm. right. Curveballs that we're trying to you this year, yeah, you deserve to treat yourself. So, that's guy. Actually, she went to work this morning. And we went up the uh, the whole idea of talking to somebody. I mean, you know, I read him up on that day like he's a rock star shrink, you know, like coming like zombies out like larks. You know? uh, <laughs> that's right. Um, actually, she she already found someone. Yeah, Peter. Uh, hmm. I don't know why I'm drawing a blank on his last name. Because <laughs> you're Peter, lying. So he's supposed to be top notch. Good, good. I'm glad you're on it. You know, that's not something that. Fester. Um, right? Hank, I, I just, uh, I, I wanted to thank you and Marie for watching the kids. Mm -hmm. I know it's, it, it really is. Mm -hmm. I know it's nice of you. And I'd like to come by tonight and see them if that's all right. Oh, of course. What do you mean? Do you have to ask, huh? All right. And it's, it's great having them. They're, they're, they're great kids. I appreciate that. I do. Hmm. You could have said this on the phone. It, yeah, he's this has another agenda. Something else on your mind? Right? Yeah. <laughs> well, feel free to, you know. <clears throat> I'm Heisenberg. <laughs> Harass me. That'd be crazy. <laughs> Skyler doesn't love me anymore. Oh. I don't know what to do. I can't find help. He better not be acting right now. No, he she. Is. Wants Hank to do something. She says that I'm <laughs> bad at influence. You better not be trying to get him in his side. Think so, huh? Bad father. I'm sorry. You're great with the kids. I think you're a good provider, um, a role model, you know. Uh, hell, He's close the blinds. He's trying to get Hank in his side. You know, people don't know what to do when someone's crying. Walt, you motherfucker. <gasps> Walt! He's gonna bug him. Is he gonna bug him? I think so. So he can hear everything they're saying, so he can always be a step ahead. Walt! How do you know he was gonna leave the room? Probably assume, you know, once he gets upset, he'll try to get him something. Bad boy, he could've just asked him to get him something. He's really bugging his shit! Oh, that's gonna piss me off. Ah! Yeah, after looking at it, act like you were looking at it. Act like you were looking at it! I remember how this felt. Hey, you two are really great together. <laughs> you take it from me, buddy. It was dark, it's just before the dawn. 
Seconds, I'm gonna dial Agent Schrader on your line here. You're gonna pass him on this information, and then we'll see what we see. And here are the rules. If you yell for help, I'm gonna pull out my pistol and shoot the man. Shit. Same goes for panicking, break you down into tears, no matter how you like to do that. Oh. If it happens this time, I am going to pull my pistol out and I am going to shoot you in the head. Look at me, not at them. Lydia, look at me. If you make Schrader suspicious, mm -hmm. anyway, anyway at all, tell me what's going to happen next. You'll pull out your gun and shoot me. And where will I shoot? In the head. That's right. <laughs> that's a pistol, not a gun. I'm expecting precision here. He ain't playing. Just don't look like you want to do that, though. The performance of a lifetime. Oh, me throwing up. Is now. Girl. She gotta read what's on that paper. This is gonna make him be in it again. Because he was not gonna be in it anymore. They don't even know well, he was done looking this for that. Uh, it's just because of the new dog. You know what I mean? Supervising it should have chemicals when I noticed a device mm -hmm. on the bottom of one of our barrels of meth. A device? So I, I was just wondering if maybe your people put it there. Not that it's any of my business, but the last thing I want to do is interfere with the a law enforcement operation or a sting. I don't know. Maybe you could give me some guidance. Um, well, I'll tell you what. Set that barrel aside for me if you would, and uh, I'll look into it and get back to you. See? Yeah, all right. Sure thing. Okay, great. Uh, thanks for the call as well. Bye-bye. Take the bait. Hey, Tommy, come here, would you? Fuck. Yeah. Hey, man. Yeah, I'm taking no. This is just their way of knowing if they're involved or not. And they're not, so she lied. She lied. Just like Mike knew. I, I know what you're thinking, but, but I didn't do it. I'm telling you, I didn't plant that thing. Shut up. And there you have it, like I said. Mm -hmm. He was right. Mm -hmm. He's going to send a team into that warehouse. He's going to wire it out to Wazoo. Bugs, cameras, the whole nine yards. So the warehouse is too hot. Her supply is useless to us now. Yeah. It depends on how fast Shrey can get his guys there. We're 900 miles closer after all. If I say now keep listening. So Sal, how much time do we have? If it's at least 12 hours when we head down there, use her security card to gain access and we take every barrel we can get our hands on. Mm. You all can only take six or seven before the suspension gives out. It's a stop gap. But right now it's the best we can do. What about her? You gonna kill her? What about her? I'll do it. Oh! No, 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 you're making a mistake. This, this was not me. I, I swear to God, I didn't do it. What if it really wasn't her? She has a gun to her head, kid. Everyone sounds like Meryl Streep with a gun to their head. Sorry, <laughs> Meryl Streep. You're the one who wanted to put it up to a vote. Oh. To a guess one. Oh. No, <gasps> no. Who oh, wants her dead? I swear, I didn't do anything. Yes. Yeah, daddy, the office, will you? No. Yeah, that's, that's gonna, it might save her. Hey, Errol, he's telling me you guys didn't do something. This lady brain has put a GPS tracker on the outside of a barrel of methamine. Um, who's asking? Did, did someone find it? It wasn't even her! Just when you put a GPS tracker on the outside of a barrel, you didn't have time to go in Goodness, she's lucky. They were, they were about to shift. We epoxied into the bottom. Hey, look at Mike, he's surprised oh, too. I mean, I don't blame him for thinking it was her, though. Well, what's headed to that warehouse anyway? Information. Sit tight. Next time, we'll communication first, all right? <laughs> Idiot. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. Asshole. No! <laughs> 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 
Right, don't get talked in that way. This has not changed the equation one iota for her. Oh, come on, you are not seriously still considering killing me. I saved you. If it were for me, we'd all be in jail right now. Right, she saw it. She I caught it. it. She's, she's right. She I, caught it. She saved our asses by finding that thing. Mm -hmm. She is saving herself. She's a loose cannon. I am telling you, she will turn a gun or a badge on us the first chance she gets. The woman. Yeah, that she messed up. She tried to kill him. Seriously? Yeah, she did. Right. What? Oh, they didn't know that. Like the mafia. They didn't know that. Yeah, yeah he didn't tell them. The mafia. Hey, you want to talk mess with me? Then <laughs> tell your partner to stop threatening me. And let's talk. Talk about what? You heard. You can't even get us a single barrel. Who said anything about barrels? I'm talking about an ocean of this stuff. Where? Where? Look at his face. Because he said it's hard to get that shit. Right. Where? Just give him a minute, would you? Trust him. <laughs> Kid, you're gonna be heartbreak. Trust him. <laughs> What's your idea? Not without a guarantee that once I tell you how to get what you want, I won't be killed anyway. I can't promise you nothing. Fine. Right. You have my word. Not good enough. Huh. Do it to it. <laughs> that has nothing to do with this. He said, he said, he said, he just answered. Yes, I have children, so what? Oh, well, I swear on your children's lives that I won't be harmed. Otherwise, how can I trust you? Right, she can't trust him. Damn. You're a smart businessman. You, you understand the concept of leverage? Please don't patronize me. The fact that he will swear not. means that he will kill her. Is it true that you put a hit out on Mike? Yes. Why? I'm scared. Of Mike? Not first. There are men who used to work with Gus Frank in custody right now. Why? They know everything about me. Everything. Something you know about you, assuming you're a master chemist. They're always talking about it. Heisenberg. If it's these nine that you're worried about, why put the hit on mine? I have no choice. I'm not going to prison. I have my daughter raised in some horrible group. Do you have any idea what those places are like? This ocean of methylene that you claim you can get your hands on. How much are we talking about? Literally. That is 24,000 gallons sent. <gasps> is she telling the truth? 24,000 gallons? It has For to come from somewhere. Of long Beach, where we have industrial chemicals. There's always a leak. The train travels east through Arizona, stops at a rail yard outside Flagstaff, where it gets broken down and rebuilt. But the methylene always moves on, destined for our pesticide concerns in Texas and Oklahoma, which means that it passes right through your home state. There's a remote three-mile stretch here in McKinney County. That's me, but she knows a lot. I'm offering you enough to fill a swimming pool. You are offering us a quick trip to prison. That's what I'm hearing. Stop in the train post 9-11. You have any idea how many alarms that's going to set off between here and D.C.? If a freight train stopped in transit anywhere other than the usual yards or depots, absolutely. A, a signal will automatically alarm the FRA and the TSA Surface Division of the Department of Homeland Security. It's a dead zone. Oh, so there's no, no automated supervision system, no alarms, no contact with control. What about cell phones? <coughs> we could just call the cops. No cellular either. I'm telling you, it's the perfect place. Parents treat you like he's a baby there. Oh, Walt Jr. Flynn, do you want me to eat up <laughs> some of that lasagna over till dinner? No. Hey, I picked up uh, Heat on Blu-ray. Want to watch it with me later? No. You can keep talking about me now. Oh! <laughs> well, no one else is going to offer stupid. Her a thing. Oh. We do it the old-fashioned way. We hit. You know, I don't have to do the math to know that we'd be making a fraction of the profit. Mm. Making less money is better than making nothing. Oh yeah, Mike. Well, why don't you tell us why? <laughs> why is making nothing? Not an option. Walter? Let me tell you why. It's because you're nine guys in lockup, right? You broke it, you paid for it. You talked about this plan. Well, maybe we better talk about you it. You broke it, you paid for it. Look at Jesse. What you're telling me, Mike, is that from now on, we have no choice but to do this piddling pseudo cook. Yeah? And it sounds like what you're telling me, Walter, is that you want to do this. Huh, helicopter, man. a couple of innocent men. That what you want? 
You know, I don't know why you insist on putting words in my mouth. But if we can rip off that train, and no one ever knows it got robbed. No. That's what y'all are trying to do. <laughs> Mike hates him. He's like, Walter? Look at him, Heisenberg. That fucking hat. <laughs> without them even knowing they're getting robbed. But how? You have to stop the train, right? But they say that it stops anyways, because then you gotta do like the repairs. But, yeah, how do you stop the train? <laughs> they would have to shut it down somehow. Oh, 814. <laughs> wow. What? What does that mean? Oh. That's it. It's perfect. Yeah. We do it here. We do it right here. Do what? Methylamine from a train is like a major rap. Point is, no one water. other than us can ever know that this robbery went down. Nobody. It's very genius. Got it? Yes, yeah. they realize it's going to be too late and they're going to be gone. Yeah, there's sure. no cameras, there's no sure. nothing. No With no all that idea. said, the whole thing relies on us. He's going to pull Hank right back in it. He's going to say, this is Heisenberg. So they'll never know we cool. So, we will be removing a thousand gallons of methylamine from the tanker car, but replacing it with about nine tenths of that volume in water. This comes to 900.24 gallons. That's Actually, on. Jesse, let's make that an even 920 to account for spillage and whatever will remain in the hose. Yeah. How are we doing, by the way? Uh, uh, 860, almost there. All right. Yeah, but won't they figure out they got robbed anyway on account of getting water down methylamine? Well, out of 24,000 gallons, it'll only amount to about 4% dilution, so. But yes, you're right. They will notice. At which point, they will blame China for sending a marginally weaker batch. Yeah, and you guys thought of everything. Yep. <laughs> So genius. Look at Jesse being smart. Look at him. <laughs> Uh-oh. You still gotta worry about Scarlet killing ass. 